it was shocking and it revealed something about my acting a little bit too late. I realized um, some of the scenes I did a great drunk, but I forgot to do the scene. Um, and I realized how inculcated that behavior had become. So when Frank isn't drinking, I, it, I had to figure out a new way to talk and a new way to carry myself. And interestingly, Frank lies all the time, but the lies became very vicious because they were real. You couldn't tell he was lying. Before, when he was in his cups, you could, you could see it. Um, uh, it's been interesting. Um, I, I mean, he's still high as a kite. I mean, he smokes a lot of reefer. And because he got a liver transplant, he gets prescription drugs. So it's not, it's, it's not like he's compass mentis, but it is a different thing. Um, and I'm digging it. And one of the best jokes ever on television, if you ask me, um, through this long thing, I, I meet a long lost, I, I have a daughter that nobody else knew about, and I thought perhaps she would be a match and I want to get her liver. And um, to make a long story short, it doesn't work. She's not a match, but she becomes enamored of me and she and someone else decide to go on the black market to find me a liver because um, I was dying. Um, it was a great season. I went on a, on uh, one of these diets where they bring you the food. So I'm not a big guy, and I lost close to 20 pounds. I was a skeleton. And uh, with John Jackson, the makeup guy, he put all this makeup on me. Man, I've seen pictures. It's scary. I look like I'm on death's door. At any rate, they decide to buy a black market liver from a, a Pakistani or an Indian doctor who goes, and they set up a little OR in a garage someplace, and for... Uh, $12,000, you can get a black market liver. So they set it all up and um, they do the, the surgery and they're packing up and he says, uh, please wait uh, 30 minutes and then call the emergency. Uh, uh, just give us time to get away. And um, so they wait and they go, I, I don't think he looks very good. So they f finally dial 911 and the EMTs come and they're packing me into the thing. And they said, you said your father had a liver transplant recently? I said, yes. And he said, how long ago? And he said, 20 minutes. I said, no, no. Someone stole one of his kidneys, but that's his liver. That's they good. stole my kidney. <laughs> Isn't that genius? So I still had to get a liver transplant. <laughs>